it's that time of the year again. Angie and I found some cranberries when we were at uh, the store the other day. The other day. <laughs> Did you say that too? The other day. And uh, so she made some awesome, I don't know what you call them, sugared cranberries? Yeah, sugared cranberries. Oh, they're so good. I can't keep my hands off of them. They're very addictive. But I guess they're not bad for you. I mean, it's got real sugar and more berry than sugar. I think that it's probably not a lot different than just having a classic cranberry juice. This no. cranberry juice has got sugar in it. No, there you go. Alright, so I've been outside today. I've braved the elements and I have blown off all the pine needles from our walkway, which will hopefully stop them from coming inside because it is pine needle season after all. And, uh, what? <laughs> Goofy dog. Uh, so I'm going to go and see if I can't start putting up some of the house lights. And Phoenix is in his room. Angie's doing PTA stuff. Stop! Stop! Stop it! What are you doing? What are you not doing, doing PTA stuff right now? Oh, well, you could have just, you know, rolled with it. But I will be doing PTA stuff after. Oh, so what are you doing right now? I'm doing stuff for Frosty Fest. Frosty Fest! Yay! We're having Frosty Fest again, and our friends are coming, so that's awesome. I'm excited about that. What's up, Coda? I've eaten food today. Yeah, yeah, you have. I've farted a lot today. Oh man! Oh. Ever. <laughs> it's like mustard gas. If you've ever changed a dog's diet, like without doing it the way you're supposed to, it, what, what are you doing? My feet are not play toys. Is it me? Is it me? Oh my gosh. Um, yeah, you change a dog's diet quickly, and then you know that's not the best thing for him. But at least he's eating. Hey, 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 space, personal space, personal space. This is what I'm worried about. These right here are supposed to be 65 feet in length. The house is 45 something from uh, gutter to gutter. So what we're gonna do is we're going to try to equally distribute this and center it on the roof and i know how to do it i know how to do it i know how to do it this actually is not one strand of lights this is this is two individual strands of lights so if we get the center point of where they connect and put the center point at the center of the roof then we'll have equal amounts on both sides well i know what to do what you can measure from there to there and then whatever you, you you get, let's say you get like 50 feet or something. Let's just say. Mm -hmm. And then like you split it in half to find the middle point and then you measure to 25. Then you get the center point. Oh, look at that. That's my boy. You're smart. Yeah. All right. Cool. Let's do this. Wow, this is so crazy. So Phoenix is uh, not dead. He's playing his Oculus, believe it or not. And um, wow, so here we go. Lights are standing uh, straight. I'm not sure I really like this though because I've always enjoyed the lights hanging on the gutters so that they kind of make it glow a little bit. But with what we have, this is the best option to make them straight. And uh, if they're big uh, C9 bulbs like this, in my opinion, they really need to be organized and straight. This will actually be the first year that I've taken this much effort to get all the bulbs straight. The other thing is, is I don't like them going up and down like this. I would, or uh, up like this. I'd rather have them going down so that water drains out of them instead of into them. So I don't know, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. But the reason why I'm putting up lights now, obviously, primarily, is because of Coda. Uh, nobody, we, we don't know what's gonna happen um, this next week with the surgery or non-surgery, but with whatever happens, I'd rather have these lights and everything just up so we can turn them on the weekend after Thanksgiving uh, in case we're blue, sad, down, depressed. Um, I don't have to worry about coming out here and doing this. So, All right, so I'm going to continue plugging along. Oh, see, I told you he was playing his Oculus. Right there. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Why is she getting up? What is she doing? 
What are you doing? What, what were you doing? I was just I going to have you oh, wave. <laughs> I thought you wanted me to do, no. say something. No, oh. I was filming him with his Oculus and then I was like... He me in the face. Oh, I saw that. Perfect timing. Starting to rain and I just got done putting all the lights up there. Now, I am not going to show you guys what they look like until it is time to turn them on. You're just going to have to wait. Troy can keep some surprises. Sometimes. Alrighty, so I don't know what to say <clears throat> This one over here Probably knew that the camera was coming on and this one over here doesn't care. Hey Coda Hey, buddy So he wasn't uh, leaving his flap alone, so we we had to cone him <laughs> Oh, he's been uh, yesterday. He had a great day and today, he's having a rough day. I guess it's uh, to be expected, but uh, still not giving up. Oh, wow. Can I show that? No. Oh. You can't. You're right, I can't. It's a surprise. It is a surprise. Angie's doing so stuff for, them, but... for um, Frosty Fest. And it's really exciting. And it's really neat. And you guys will see it when Frosty Fest returns <laughs> all right so I wanted to make sure that we uh, at least said something to uh, some of the comments uh, today uh, Bren you said first when was the last time you were first Bren and it's becoming increasingly easier what is being first oh <laughs> um, <laughs> I thought you were saying that he said that oh no I said that oh you said that I did say that okay. Uh, Halloween fur. Okay, sounds good to me. I just want to make sure that you get it and that it did not get lost. Yes, I will be checking the P.O. box uh, today when you see this. So tomorrow for me still. Uh, Halloween fur. you also say, also I watched the new Five Nights at Freddy's movie last night. It's pretty good. Oh, I missed that when you said new. You did say new. You did say new. I had asked you earlier after I read this comment if it was new. I've always liked the video game and the movie's pretty good to pretty good too you and Angie should watch it I don't know about Phoenix because it's PG-13 but you and Angie should definitely mm. he said that it came out uh, in October in theaters and Peacock so yeah I've actually I have played the video game once or twice yeah I think I've played it once it's been out for twice, a while three times I don't know I've played it three times yeah it's been out for quite a while now <laughs> three times three times <laughs> Uh, ben Massey, my snack was ice cream drumstick, and movie was Kane Mutiny Court Martial. Hmm. I want a drumstick now. <laughs> I want some candy corn. No. Oh, yeah. No. 360 Steven Troy, thanks. Great video. You're welcome. You might be lying, and I appreciate it. <laughs> Man, I saw, like, Trucker Josh's video the other day. It had been out for like a day, I think, and it had 12,000 views. Wow. I've been doing this for a while, and I know things haven't been that interesting as of late. But man, I, I don't know how, I mean, besides starting another channel and getting into a different algorithm, I just, I don't know. I don't know. I want things to be bigger. Gotta do less couch vlogging then. Less couch vlogging. <laughs> You're probably not wrong. Uh, Tony Fredrickson, happy weekend, Beyonders. Uh, happy weekend to you. And uh, 367 Stefan88, uh, thanks, Troy. Great video. I think I already said that, didn't I? Oh, I guess I did. See, and if I didn't repeat myself over and over and do the same thing every day. Hey, it's raining. Hey, I'm working on a car. Hey, we're having dinner. Okay, stop. You're just being all negative now. Oh, I don't want to be negative. No, you need no to stop. I don't. Stop. It's raining outside. Stop. Yeah. It that, is. That's not negative. No. Because I don't have to be outside right now. So. Wow. <laughs> so that's awesome. I like the rain. I like the rain, too. It Do does you, though? It does wonderful things. It makes the flowers and the trees and the grass grow. Well, that sounds really forced. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it. Happy hunting. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate you guys.
I do. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye!